Hi, I am Joy. Welcome to Joy Sharing channel. This channel is all about sharing. Sharing in a budget, sharing when you can spend money, sharing with products available in India, sharing with products which you can import, and anything related to sharing. I am a sharing enthusiast and uh, this has inspired me to make some videos. So for today's shave, we are going to use mostly Gillette products which are the Gillette 7 o'clock plastic razor. Black. This is available everywhere in India, in retail shops, in Kirana stores or even with the chemists. The blade is the Gillette 7 o'clock Parma Sharp, this one which is available in a pack of 5 or 10 the brush is Gillette nylon vessel brush it is a bit stiff and it is quite old because I used it for a very long time and uh, it is a plastic handle brush for aftershave I am not going to use any aftershave lotions or balm today since this is a budget shave I will use alum stone. This is the most natural astringent and the best aftershave uh, treatment which you can do to your skin. So starting with the preparation, uh, what all things you need apart from these? Uh, you need a mug full of water to rinse your razor or you can rinse it under the tap if you have the water availability within your area. In addition to this, you may require a napkin or cloth to wipe uh, your face. And for pre-shave, uh, you would require to wash your face with a face wash. You can wash your face with soap, but the soap dries your skin and it makes it kind of stretchy. With a face wash, your uh, stubble would be moisturized and when you you know, blind the razor, it would be easy to shave. It would not be like this, it would be like this. Easy. I'm sorry. So, let's start with the face wash, the pre shave. Apply water to your face. Take a small dollop of face wash like that. And this is a shaving station face wash. You can use any face wash which is moisturizing and not dry. And it also depends on your skin type. Apply the face wash on your hands and start applying the face wash in circular motions like this. And cover every part of your skin which ever you want to shave this is a non foaming kind of face wash so the lather is not very rich in this face wash but this moisturizes very well rinse your face with cold water and then just uh, uh, wipe the bit of water not all of the water don't let don't let your face dry okay then the first step is rather the second step is to apply some water on your face uh, dip your shaving brush into water and remove the excess water from it take your shaving cream 
and you can apply shaving cream directly on your brush like that take this much amount and you can experiment in your shaves how much amount is sufficient for you then start applying the other on your face The other is kind of dry, so I'm going to just put some drops of water in the brush itself, or you can just dip the bristles of the brush in the water. So after you know applying the cream, after spreading the cream some time uh, on your face, you can then distribute the lather evenly all across your face, whichever area you want to shave, and especially your neck. Your lather should rather be consistent uh, with the texture of yogurt or cream and it should be moisturizing it should not be drying on your skin see how rich the lather is now this brush is not the best brush available in India but it gets the job done so for anyone on budget this is a good brush to use in a shave ok so now the lather is creamy and you can see there are peaks in the lather that means your lather is uh, ready and uh, nicely done and now you can start shaving ok so on the first pass I will do with the grain which is downward and on the second pass I will do across the grain in this direction and uh, probably I will do a third pass if my skin permits uh, from uh, left to right uh, and let's so start the shave stretch your skin this will uh, bring your whiskers a bit up and it will be easy to shave so clear your sideburns first so that you have a lining and it is even on both sides and then just easily glide the river no pressure even easy strokes about one one and a half inch at a time and that should be sufficient for the removal of the whiskers you can you know blow air in your mouth to stretch the skin near your moustache and nose area and then you can shave There is a kind of bit audio feedback which is quite, quite plasticky but that's okay. It's shaving very well. I can see. Yeah, it's quite smooth.
Sanctus ki review, Nunda Rights case, no pressure at all. If you apply pressure and shame, or if you by mistake do like that, the blade inside the razor is going to cut you, and that is going to be a problem. So it will come with practice, but uh, you need to be a bit careful in any with any kind of razor or any kind of sharp object. Now I will clear the area near my moustache because I don't want to shave my moustache. And so the area just below my lower lip. I like to keep these hair, the moustache and uh, this and so I uh, Okay, so first class done, we will now rinse, uh, I will now rinse my face and then we will come back for pass number 2. So I had about uh, one and a half days of growth. I shaved on Saturday morning and this is Sunday evening and I can already feel that it's quite smooth it's not very closely or it's not baby bottom smooth but it's quite smooth by doing this shave I can go to the office without any problems let the water on your beard be there because you need to keep it moisturized and apply the remaining uh, lather just use painting kind of motion and you can always take the extra lather from the brush, brush by rotating it a bit and you don't need very thick lather on your second and third passes. You just need to cover your skin so that there is a barrier between your skin and the blade directly. In some cases, uh, I have found that shaving oils are also much better and they are as good as shaving creams. Second pass, this direction. Second pass. 
this is the excitement which you have which is so on my neck area I cannot go across neither against the wheel I have to go with the wheel it is very sensitive for most of the men and so I can only do uh, with the game grip in my second and third passes also on the neck but it gives me a cool shape it looks good so if I if I do like that I feel smooth if I do like that there is a bit of trouble and you can hear that if I do like that it is kind of smooth but not here this is also a very sensitive area for many of the men so find your hair growth direction and then choose the best you know direction to shape second pass done rinse off Then if you feel that your uh, lather is dry, you can apply some water to the bristles and just spread it. This method of lathering is known as uh, face lathering, in which you lather directly on your face. And this exfoliates your face as well. So now third pass, this direction, neck, again with the wheel. Cannot go here again on the neck. So not much stubble left after two passes. I'm trying to avoid applying any kind of pressure.
it is a natural astringent readily available everywhere in all parts of the world and it's quite inexpensive